Hello! Hello, 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 hello. How's it going? Welcome back to the Gold and the Goblet series. This is, uh, I was gonna say golf with your friends week. I mean, in a way, it is golfing with your friends. I got, uh, Ryan and Dan and anybody playing along at home. But, uh, no, it's the golf club featuring B BGA? PGA Tour. My mouth is not working so well. Um... Today we're playing the uh, TPC South Wind course. Hello there and Again, pretty sure I played all of the courses that we've been playing throughout this week, but I can't. And today I'm pleased to be joining you. Can't remember any specific ones or or holes or, or anything like that. So, um. Let's go. Anyways, let's uh. What the heck? Figure out what's going on here. I want to send it. I want to send it. There is wind there. Let's just, um... Let's just, let's just give her. Watch, I mean, the tree here, it might screw us. Um, it looked like it did slow us down, but honestly, we're, we're right at the end of the fairway. We weren't going to make it to the green anyway, so we're going to have to make a second shot. Uh, this is a fine with me. It's fine with me. Little lob wedge action. Uh, uphill a bit. We got some wind to deal with. Let's bring it over a bit more. And, uh, up the loft as well. There we go. Okay, come on down and... Oh, that's beautiful. I thought the wind was going to take it a bit more. Um, that was... I'm, I mean, look, if you look our distance, like, we came from over here. We landed, like... If we went to the right, we would have just gone straight down into the hole. I mean, you know, that would have been pretty cool. All right, we're downhill, and there's a slope. I'm scared. Um, let me think here. I gotta, I gotta practice one more. Oh, rim job. I didn't want to hit it. Starting around under par. So I'm, I'm getting better at like, I wanted to move it more left um, than I did just because I knew I wasn't going to hit it too hard. I wanted the downslope to carry it a bit more and just the less speed you get, the easier it breaks. And so I was in my mind, I was like, we should go more left, but I don't know. It, it worked out, but uh it's also kind of nice in a way knowing like going into that like I did kind of have the right idea and I shouldn't have hesitated on going a bit more left um, or aiming a bit more left but anyways it ended well which is nice uh, we can get over this tree let's pull our loft back we got wind to our back as well it's actually, it is uphill though, but no, we should be fine. Not a great swing. Um, you can tell <laughs> we went over to the left here. Uh, I mean, you can see my kind of my line there. Uh, that's unfortunate because we could have been on the green right now if we had played that better, but it is. As they say what it is. Let's get her going. Oh, baby. I put a... I don't want to say... I put a little backspin on that. I, I, I guess I could have put more. But uh, it, it slowed it down pretty quickly. And we got ourselves a... 
fairly nice looking putt here. Don't hit it too hard. There's a slope though. Nicely done. Let's go. I'll take a birdie. I'll take a birdie. Pretty bird. Pretty bird. All right. Good way to start with a couple of uh, birdies. Let's let's try to stay focused, though. Uh, it only takes one hole to slip up, and if you slip up, you know me. It uh, it, it, it can crush my confidence, so uh, I'd rather just avoid that situation altogether. We've got little winds. It might carry us a bit, so that's kind of why I'm, I'm aiming a touch to the left here. Slightly better swing than our, 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 our drive than our previous hole. Okay, we're sitting at around 110 yards to the pin. 110 yards. Neither uphill nor down. Wind to our back. Sand wedge. I'm going to use a sand wedge here. Okay, and send it. Oh, that's looking quite nice. A little bit of a bounce, not too much roll. And looks like you're putting for eagle from here. This is for eagle. Oh, I didn't realize I wasn't looking at the par five. It is slightly uphill. Oh, rim job. Dude, Malf, you're scaring me. You got to aim a little bit more to the left. Three, three, three. Oh, baby. I'm liking this. I need a sip of water here. The first third is done. Um, okay, we're downhill. Going up against a little wind. Not too much. The, I think... Yeah, you kind of want to get the lob wedge here. And just uh, crank it. Crank it. Bad, bad uh, swing. I mean, I, I, I was saying it as I was pulling back. Um, you can see the slow there. Very nice. Very nice. I don't think so. This is a, a very tough looking birdie because right at the end here it, you can see the the white lines if you're if you're trying to like watch this game as we go um and understand how you read the greens you've got the grid here and then these white lines the direction they're moving and the speed that they're moving kind of it tells you what the slope is so if it's moving from left to right that means it's going it's sloping down to the right um, the speed at which the lines move tells you how much it's sloping. So the faster it moves, that means it's um, fairly steep. So that's that's kind of how you uh, you start to read these. And then after a while, you get a bit of an idea, like a point of reference. You're like, all right, like it's moving that fast, which means I probably should aim like this much to the left or that much, so on and so forth. Um, uh, yeah. Uh, it's tricky though when it's moving in multiple directions uh, on your your path to the hole, but overall it's moving more right to left. Um, it is also six feet up, so this is gonna be or six inches up. Definitely not six feet up. This will be an interesting one um, for a par three. Yeah, we gotta we gotta do some work here. Have gone more to the right. Great weight, though. I'm, I'm ext I mean, that was perfect. Literally, almost the perfect yeah, putt. You gotta, you gotta yeah. pat yourself on the back for that one. That's just, uh, I mean, we almost, we actually almost yeah, put that, that in. Putt to end this one. I am in. Wow. Right there wow. That one. Three, 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 three. This is just, it's the field of, of threes, the round of threes. Okay. 
I'm almost happy I I parred that just to maintain our our three theme. Oh my gosh! All right, so we got a par five. We are going against the wind here, so I feel like I can push this with the driver, and uh, and we'll have a nice layup. All right, decent swing. I think this looks pretty safe. Looks pretty safe. I'll agree, John. We're on the fairway, and, and from here, we're right around 170 yards out. All right, five feet down. We got some wind to deal with. Just bring that over. Um, and six iron. So we will get some roll on this. The lower the number, like the loft automatically changes again, if you didn't know that. So, um, think of it, just imagine like a nine iron. Uh, I don't know what the actual angle is on the, uh, on the head of the clubs that I've never gotten that into it. But if you just imagine that a nine iron, was 45 degree angle then you could say like a six iron might be like you know 30 degree angle or something like that right so um the lower the angle uh 30 means that it's gonna you're not gonna put it as high you're gonna put it further and if it's going at a lower trajectory right it's gonna roll more hopefully i explained that um sufficiently uh, so that's why I just, uh, when I'm using my irons, if I see the circle here, just because the ball lands there, doesn't mean that's where it's going to stop, right? With a six iron, we're going to, we're going to roll a bit more. If this were a nine iron, it's going to come down, not like perfectly straight, but it'll, it'll bounce, but it won't roll as much. So that's why I kind of want to, uh, neuter my, my loft here a bit. Let's try that. A little slow. Yeah, I mean, you can look at my swing. I, I butchered it, and then uh, the wind, the wind really hurt us. That's just, that's just, that's just my 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 swing. My hand not doing uh, what I'm what I'm asking it to do. Um, let's do this. Another not great swing, but it's better. So I think this Here is for birdie. This one for birdie. Man, I wanted the eagle because then it would have been uh, another three on the score sheet. Oh my gosh, I'm actually close, amazed. Close. All right, we're close. Let's uh, let's just drop this and move on. I what I. You could have had a birdie there. I, I think you know that. I he John. Yes, I know. I could have had a birdie there. I I feel bad because I kind of rushed that one. I was like, eh, it's there's no downhill. It's six six feet. That's not much. You know, I I kind of in my head, I I treated it like it was a, a gimme. Can't do that, and uh, it cost us. It cost me greatly. All right, send it. Oh my gosh, that's a solid swing. Bounce on, there you go. Nice. Par four, let's see, we're flopping it. It's uphill, let's give it a little extra high loft just to stop any, any uh, rolling and such. Good. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. See, very minimal roll because you 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 put right, the the backspin on it. Wait, backspin or f yeah, backspin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Do not treat this like it's uh, an easy putt. That's where we got into trouble. Nice. <laughs> I keep underestimating how much I gotta aim to the left on these. Or give them a, just a little bit more speed. Oh man, like a three, 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 five, three. Ah! We should have had a birdie too. 
on the last one. That's that's really what gets you, but um boom, boom, boom. hole seven. Par four. Nothing nothing too zany. Little bit of wind. Let's push it to the right here. And uh it then the ball would move a bit to the left and that would be hunky dory. And let's uh let's crush it. A little slow on the backswing, but otherwise pretty good, pretty good. Pretty much went where we were uh aiming anyways. Okay. Uphill. A little wind. Um pitch. Gonna do the pitching pitching wedge pitch, not the nine iron. I know there's a bit of wind, but I'm just going to send it. Get a bit of roll here. Uh, yep. I would have liked a little more, but... And here we go for the birdie. For the birdie. All right, bring it over. It's moving right to left. Down, uh, down that way. Uphill there. Oh baby! Nice putt. You're in there. <laughs> oh my gosh! Six under for the round. This guy, three. Let's go. <laughs> nice solid birdie on the hole. <sighs> we got another birdie in the works here. Um, par three. Bit of wind. Downhill. All right, that's where you got to be careful. The downhill. Push that over that way, and then we'll we'll up our loft just a touch as well. Don't go in the sand. Uh oh, slow on the backswing is really gonna hurt us. Yep, that swing entirely hurt me. Okay, we're not getting full power on this. So, let's just send it. And I put uh, extra loft. It's getting more roll than I want. A lot more. <laughs> um, oh, I really want to save par, but this is a, it's a nasty looking putt. It's uphill too. Wow. Three inches uphill. Oh, I hit that so hard. I mean, not like excessively, but um, All right, drop this one I thought the bogey. I thought it would break a bit more. Oh, this breaks my heart, man. Man. All right. Just stay calm. Downhill. Nice stroke on that one. Man. That hurts. Oh, the red. Oh, no. Hole number nine. It's all because of that gosh darn sand. I didn't, uh, I didn't get the swing off. And we landed short. This one. Let's just see. Can we make it over that tree? Yeah, like almost certainly. The scary thing is the wind. It's actually like, oh no. <laughs> I was gonna say it's great that I got a perfect swing um, because I wouldn't have Maybe made it over those trees. That's going to cost us a stroke. I honestly... I mean, the wind, yeah. I assume the wind wouldn't take us as much as it did, so... That's, uh... It's going to hurt us as well, but... 
Let's try to finish finish uh, finish strong here. Um, you're hearing those horns because somebody uh, is resubscribing to my Twitch stream. Um, <laughs> they might have auto renew on, so twitch.tv slash Michael A.L. Fox if you got a, a Twitch Prime burning a hole in your pocket. You could, you could, you could, you could also get some, uh, some horn action going on. Uh, I gotta focus here. Those horns, you know, that's BM during golf. Trying to focus here. That is uphill. Alright, let's do this. Oh, the wind or something. I mean, my swing wasn't that bad. It was a little fast. A lot of green to cover for that next shot. And this... we're putting from about 28 feet out. Yikes. This is for par, dude. We're uh, undoing our work here. And it doesn't make me happy. All right. One inch uphill, nearly 30 feet, I'm trying to get a, an idea for how hard to hit that. Okay, just focus. Uh oh. I swear, like, I know it wasn't that uphill, but I, 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 oh no. 17 feet out here. 17. This is not, this is terrible. This is, uh, and it's four inches uphill now, so it's like, now my, my reference is like way off. Didn't hit it hard enough. All right. All right, let's put this one in for the double bogey. <laughs> for the double bogey. Oh, man. Nice putt. We're in there. Well, it's the round of th the round of threes. Three under when it's all said and done. So three under. Right, thanks. 33 look at that 30 it's it's actually it's actually amazing three 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 five three three well then four six but still it's a lot of threes um that's a shame because that should have been <laughs> um i want to say uh, 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 uh an easy par really for that last hole five under and like this one definitely definitely should have been a birdie we could have wow you really screwed it up on the last two mouth. That said, you know, it's uh, it's golf. It's fun. And uh, uh, other than these uh, couple little little bumps and bruises at the end, I, I played fairly well. I had some good putts. Like, a lot of these uh, these birdies here, I think they were pretty well earned. Uh, as well. When you look at, like, there weren't a lot of easy, easy, straightforward putts. Pretty much all of them were requiring a little calculating. So, I don't want to beat myself up uh, too much about the end there. It's just, it's kind of a shame you play well for, you know, three quarters of it, and then you kind of, bleh. Anyways, um, you know, thank you guys so much if you, if you watched the whole video. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, consider clicking the like button. Uh, comments and all that stuff, of course, are 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 more than welcome. And please make sure you're watching all perspectives, uh, whether I'm the first stop, middle stop, or last stop. Um, thank you for supporting the Golden Goblet series, and I will see you guys tomorrow for the next course. Until then, peace.